Hello guys, it's me Brian. I'm um, sorry about that. If you hear like, I'm in your room. I'm in my room. So yeah. Okay. So today I'll be showing you how to install on Ventrilo and how you to install the server. This thing is really easy. So let's get started. First, I want you to go to your internet browser. Um, just go to Google or whatever thing you use. Um, type Ben Trillo. And then something like this might appear on your screen, so you just click download. Okay. Here's the things that you need. If you already have Ben Trillo, the client program, if you have it, it's okay. You don't need to download. But if you don't have it, download it. If you have window, Windows 30p, um, 32 bit download this one and 64 bit download this one I have this one so I already have downloaded and installed here okay now to install the server you just go where it says server programs and you click on where it says windows and you just download it you go all the way down and you click agree I think I should have mine so yeah so you just agree and install it's not hard to install it's really really easy okay now once you're here you know that way you don't have to go back to the internet browser okay I want you okay now you gotta access your your router so to access your router to see the the IP you have so you press CMD and press enter you search it up and it's right there so now you gotta type here IP config no space guys no space there you go that should be your IP your well not your IP address it's this one my bad the default getaway and that's how you're gonna access your router so let's type it see mine says here it's gonna ask you for a password and the password it should be um admin you don't need to put a username but if it's not admin then I guess whoever installed your wireless change the password and I don't know if you have it or your mom has it but whatever that password is to access your router you must um, put it and then log in okay so now you go to your application gaming okay here we go now here's the thing that you have to do so if you go to application gaming and port range forward this is a linkest router by the way guys I don't know how to do with another routers but it should kind of be almost the same but this is for linkage routers only I think I don't know I only have linkage so I haven't tried any auto router okay so now you gotta click this information here you're gonna click this number the port which is usually what Ventrilo has um, and put it here on start and then end protocol you should have them on both because it recommended now how to get this thing right here you're not gonna put any random thing you go back to the thing you open and it should be here mine is different because this is my other PC my desktop that's where I run the server from I run it from this computer okay so you put the IP says there mine here and the other one says you see here one one zero so you click it and then you put enable and then once you're done you put save settings and that's how you do it okay now you can put this down now okay you can close this now to start the server if you already download and install it you just go to where it says open your start all programs and you scroll down to you see bent and then this now you open edit m i m i file and there you go so that's the name of the server right now. Uh, well, this is my server, but the one I'm hosting on the other computer has nothing to do with this. This is just an example because I don't know. Okay, so you know, you change the name of the server you want it to be, the thing next to the name you want it to be, um, the password you want it to be, the admin password, and the password to sign in in the server and pretty much that's it and then you just save okay now you're done here 
Now, you should see a Bertillo server here. You open it up, and that's your server. You should see your information here. Your name and your your thing you put next to the name. So now you open Ventrilo. You might put this down. You cannot close this. This is the thing that runs the server. So if you close it, you're screwed. As you can see here, I'm connected to another server. Well, let's delete it. Now here you're going to type the name of the server. Okay, the IP. Okay, the password. Say so now it says server is available, so you just click on it. There you go, I'm in the server already. And this little A means that there's an admin on it. Now, some people, I'm gonna make this video kind of longer, but some people want to find how to make channels. So here it is. So you click on this, you right click it, and you gotta sign in as, okay, I'm already signing in, but okay. So you guys where it says channel admin. So you click here, create, and then you just click the name of the program, oops the the channel you want to make and you can put a password so I'll put in my password or oh, nobody can access it. clear specific names already taken it says it's already taken because remember I'm um my brother has a server on his computer which is the desktop desktop over there so I'll be making another video well you don't I don't need to make another video because so basically you just click here and create channel you click whatever you want Press OK and then should appear here. But that was a problem with my thing. It doesn't appear here because I don't know why. Because I guess since I'm using the same internet um, as the other desktop, I think, and they're different IPs, so I, that's why I decided to host it from the other computer. But you shouldn't have any problems. With it. So that's how you connect, um, how, that's how you get Ventrilo and you connect it to a server as you saw me and that's how you make a server and that's how you create a channel it should appear a channel like I did it but mine doesn't appear because I'm have another um, server running so if you want to join my other Ventrilo um, the Ventrilo server which me and my brother host um, just I will leave that the, the, the description I'll leave on the description the information on it so you guys could join and then we may play Minecraft together or something, right? So, Alright guys, so that's all for today and hopefully, hopefully this helped you. So, peace out. I'll see you next time.